Here, let us see what are the types of angles. The first type of angle is called as the right angle. A right angle is nothing but an angle which measures exactly 90 degrees. So this is called as a right angle. And right angles are usually denoted by this thing that I am highlighting. Usually angles are shown like say something like this, a curvy thing. But for right angles, if there is no 90 degrees and if there is this kind of a thing, then that itself indicates it is a right angle. And we can name this, say for example, AOB. So angle AOB equals 90 degrees. Let us look at another type of an angle, which is called as an acute angle. An acute angle is an angle whose measure is greater than 0 degrees but is less than 90 degrees. So it is less than 90 degrees. We can name it say BOC. So angle BOC is less than 90 degrees and it is greater than 0 degrees and it is called as acute angle. So defining acute angle, acute angle is any angle whose measurement is greater than 0 degrees but is less than 90 degrees. More examples for acute angle can be, say, 36 degrees, 48 degrees, 60 degrees, and so on. Now, the next kind of an angle is obtuse angle. An obtuse angle is nothing but, it is an angle whose measure is more than 90 degrees. So, we have the reference line of 90 degrees as here. So let us for a minute go back to acute angle. We have 90 degrees here. So any angle to the right side of this line, this, 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 everything will be acute angle. Now as far as an obtuse angle is concerned, any line that makes an angle with the horizontal and, and if that line is beyond this line, say this one or this one, all these kind of lines are obtuse angle and it has to stop here max it cannot go beyond 180 degrees so an obtuse angle is an angle which is greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees let us name this say for example let us consider this line as to be the obtuse angle we can name it foG so angle foG is equal to it can be anything it may be let's say it's 120 degrees over anything less than 180 and greater than 90 degrees. The next one is called as the straight angle. A straight angle is nothing but an angle which is exactly equal to 180 degrees. Now we know that this is a 90 degree and so this is also a 90 degree. So when you add 90 and 90 you get an angle equal to 180 degrees. And this can be named as, say, GOF. Angle GOF is equal to 180 degrees. And yeah, it can also be read as angle FOG. And this can also be read as angle GOF. This can also be read as angle COB, BOA, and so on. So this is straight angle, which is exactly equal to 180 degrees. Now we have one final kind of an angle left that is called as a reflex angle. A reflex angle is an angle which is greater than 180 degrees. So we have the 180 reference point here. So any line say like this, this is the center point of the vertex or say this or say this or this or this or this. Everything is in reflex angle except that it is measured from here as usual. From the horizontal to the line whichever is inclined. So it's like this. So similarly, reflex angle is also like this or say like this. So say 
this is also a reflex angle if it is measurement is like this so defining reflex angle reflex angle is an angle which is greater than 180 degrees and less than 360 degrees so a reflex angle is an angle that lies between 180 degrees and 360 degrees if we can name this as say for example this is the o and this can be SOT. So angle SOT is a reflex angle, which is reflex angle is greater than 180 degrees and is less than 360 degrees.